Hey guys, Jen Bruno Smith here. I am here with one of our mastermind students, Deanna Sedwick, from, Seswick, um, from, <laughs> from Portland, Oregon, of Deanna Seswick Photography. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm so excited to see you. Thanks. Thank you. I'm super excited. It's, it's so great to be part of this uh, mastermind group and being able to talk to you. So thank you for that. I love that. So tell me a little bit about where you were before you started the mastermind. How many clients were you seeing? What your sales average was? Mm -hmm. So right before so I joined, like I think I was one of the first ones that joined in, in uh, March. Um, so before that, like I was still in my mind, I was successful. Um, I was having like, you know, like 10, 15 clients a, a month. And then my average sale was like $600. I was always busy. So in that mind, in that mindset, I was like, yeah, I'm doing great. Um, but I wasn't <laughs> because I was so tired and I was always working and I was having this like always picture my stomach that I'm doing something wrong, that I'm just not nailing it. Um, so it was really stressful for me, even though financially it wasn't bad, but I was just overworking myself. Um, and, but I loved it <laughs> in that point. Now that I'm kind of doing this, I feel like a little bit more professionally. I feel so much more calm and so much uh, more as a professional. And I just feel really good about where I'm at with my clients and with my business. And um, it's, a, it's a good place to be right now, for now. I love that. So what are some of the biggest changes that you've seen in your business since you started our mastermind? Um, I see, I see a lot of changes. I see, uh, well, the quality of clients that I'm having, um, um, that's huge because again, like I'm presenting myself in a very different way. So I'm attracting different clients. Um, I'm way more confident. And one of the biggest things that I really love from the mastermind course is I took all of your, I took your pricing, I took all of your emails. Um, and that really helped me uh, streamline my, my interactions with clients. So it's making my life so much easier. Like I literally just, you know, like I book them and you know, uh, automation does it all for me. And I just, you know, I see them on the day of the shoot and like we can move on. So there's just so many changes, not to mention I'm earning way more money. <laughs> Yay. <Which I> love. <laughs> uh, so like th there's just, I feel that um, there's all these little details that help me get where I'm at right now. And I don't think, you know, I'm trying not to compare myself to others who are earning way more um, because it's not about money for mm. me. Like I really do enjoy what I'm doing. Um, but it's, for me, where I was, you know, even like six months ago and where I'm at right now, um, I'm, I'm really, really happy with everything that I learned from the, everybody else in the group and you and Humberto. I love that. I love that. So um, if you were to recommend our mastermind to one of your friends, what would you say? I do it all the time, basically. <laughs> I love that. Um, you know, what I would, I would definitely, I think this is one of the things that I'm very blunt. And I obviously I ramble a lot. Um, so like one of the things about mastermind course is that like you really have to work for it. Like, you know, there's not one thing except prices that you just can copy if you want. There's not one thing in this course that like it's just going to make it happen for you. So if my friends and most of them are in a place that they're ready, like they want to make it happen, they want to put the work, um, then I think this course is going to be amazing for them. So I just tell them like, hey, once you're ready to put in work, it's going to be amazing because it really gives you all the tools. Um, there's not one thing about going in person sales and boudoir, but it's not just boudoir because I photograph headshots and I'm using your, your course for headshots and I'm using it for maternity clients. So it's not just boudoir. Um, I just tell them that you really have to be ready and you have to, you know, like watch the videos and do all those things and you have to present yourself as a professional because people will really react to that. Um, I can be friendly and I'm awkward and I curse. <laughs> so like, you know, I'm still myself with my clients, but I, yeah, all right. <laughs> they like that. Um, makes you feel more human. Um, but um, I'm, I'm still myself, but I'm professional. And that's, I feel that made a huge difference for me when I joined the course and I realized like, okay, I have all the tools. I can be who I was meant to be as a business owner. Um, so I'm sorry, I rambled, but the whole point is like, you know, when I, when I do recommend it to my friends, I just say that it's freaking amazing and that there's not like, you know, from ads, from, um, you know, email automation, from your price list, from interactions with clients, there's just so many good, good things about it. Um, it's kind of like surprise education for boudoir. So like there's it's everything. Um, so there's really not one thing that I recommended them. I just say, I just tell them how much money I'm earning and they're like, oh yeah, I'll join. <laughs> 
I love that you said that you're using what you've learned in the mastermind for other genres too. Mm -hmm. Tell me more about that. I love that. Well, I think because my, my business is working with women, like, I mean, I do photograph men here and there, but like it's mostly with women and the things that we, you know, that you guys teach us in mastermind, it's not necessarily about boudoir. Like, yeah, there's posing, um, and, but like, you know, lighting and client interaction and talking over on the phone that with the script, um, you know, like priceless, all those things can be applied, you know, for everyday client, for like maternity, for families. I just had a maternity client yesterday and I've been using that same script with her for a phone call and I've been using the same prices for her and it works. So I think like the only thing that's like very boudoir specific, um, but it, it's posing that, that you guys show, but like even that, um, that it's such a small part of what you're teaching us that like, it's not, it shouldn't be, um, what is the word? Deterrent. Um, I'm just, foreigner, yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. So, that's great. So yeah. that's like catch myself saying foreign word. I'm like, haha, I know that word. <laughs> um, but like, you know, I, I think there's, um, yeah, there's just so many things that like for every genre you can learn. Even like for headshots, like I use some of your emails and I just, you know, make them less like, hey, gorgeous and more like, hi, <laughs> you. Right, right. Um, but like, I still use them because it's, it gives you all this information that um, I, you know, I could come up with it myself, but it would take me months and like and all these little, little details that you put into those emails and in your price list are just so huge um and for me it's like i have i'm embarrassed to say so but once i joined the mastermind and i started booking and i started like doing all the work i didn't have i still didn't have enough time to watch all the videos and do all the everything else that there is in, in a uh, in a course because i'm so booked i don't have i don't have time for it so once i'm there and That's i started wonderful. Yeah, so like once I'm there and I actually start like, you know, watching everything and doing everything, I'm sure it's going to be even better. But for me, um, I'm, I'm good. I'm good right now. For so now. What would you say to photographers that maybe shoot other genres that are thinking about the mastermind but are kind of on the fence or even photographers that are in the boudoir genre that are kind of on the fence about it and have been thinking about it but just not ready yet to pull the trigger? What would you say? I say do it. <laughs> I think that, um, I think we put so much stress about like, um, I think we're so concerned about like, you know, what if it doesn't work? But like, that's such a wrong way to think about it. Like, if you think it's not gonna work, it's not gonna work because you're not ready for it. So my advice would be like, just, you know, like sign in and then once they see all the content, once they see how easy it is for you, literally just to copy stuff. Like I wasn't ready to, in that first point, like, you know, to make any adjustments and to think about what's going to work. I just literally copied your stuff. I copied your script when I was talking to clients for the first few times, like I would just like say exactly what you told me to say. Um, and, and it worked. And then like with time, I adjusted it to make it like more my style and more my voice. Uh, but there's really, I, I, you know, for people who are, who are doing in-person sales, like, you know, the, the amount of money that you spend for, you know, being part of this course is like what one sale? Like, is that really yes. something that you should be, yeah, like worried about? I mean, obviously, like you know, it is an investment, but it's investment in yourself and your business. And for me, going from in March when I was like playing around, and I was like, oh yeah, I was I was charging unethically, um, and I just because I was so scared to charge. Like, so mm -hmm. if I saw if somebody would book me and they were like, I think that they could afford me, I would give them like higher price if I thought they couldn't afford me I'll give them lower price so I was just keep like playing around um because I didn't know I was I was so scared of all of this process of in-person sales and just like the course itself just and being able to like be in the group and ask all the questions without fear without shame like because everybody's in the same place and and people are now like kind of getting to this like higher level so like it's so nice to have group of people that you can you know like talk about money there's no money shame there's no business shame like there's not such thing as like oh like you know i'm embarrassed to talk about stuff like so the whole group is is so useful and the content is so useful so there's really nothing that i can say negative about the the mastermind it's just it's just a matter of like you know people who are either ready to make a jump and um and put a work in and really put a work in or people who are like, Oh, I don't know. Because that was me. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, maybe I'm sure. Yeah. I got this, you know? So yeah. 
Just I love that you mentioned the community that we have because mm -hmm. our students in the exclusive group, our mastermind students, because, you know, so, so we started in February and a lot of the students that started with us are beta testers. Mm -hmm. right now they've leveled up so much that they will sometimes answer questions well before Umberto and I can even get to them because they are so experienced. They're making double, triple what they were before. So you know, the community is a huge part of it. It is. It is. And especially because everybody's on the same page and everybody's kind of having the same attitude about their business and working with clients as well. So it really does help going into that group with a question that I have and, and knowing that, again, people from all these different time zones, um, yeah. like, you know, for example, if I see something at 2 a.m. and I need to know the answer, I can post and then like people from Germany are going to answer it for me because they're awake. <laughs> so they're awake. Right. Yeah, it is really nice. Um, I really, I, I've, it's really hard for me to be like, um, I'm, I'm trying like to be more open about my business, like, because I always kind of keep it for myself. Like it's such a precious thing to me. Like the fact that I, I started like, you know, I'm pretty fresh in it and I just kind of like, I'm doing really well. So it's like really like, I'm not ashamed of it, but like, I always kind of like, you know, that's my thing. So I'm trying to be more open about it just so others can know as well. Like this is a real deal. You know, like I didn't just, it works and, and friendships that you create in a group and communication and all this help and all this content in the, you know, on, a, on your website. Like there's just so many things that makes it easy for you to go from like being a regular photographer to a badass photographer. I love that. I need to put that on a t-shirt. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Oh, that is my word. I just use I, it all the time for everything. I love it. Well, thank you so much for your time. And thank you for trusting us and making the leap. And I'm so proud of you. And I'm so happy for you. I love that. I can't wait to continue watching you grow. So yes, thanks. I really appreciate it and everything you do. And thank you so much for having me. Yeah, of course. See you later.